Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. I know for a fact a lot of people have been looking forward to video or two that I'm making on my Mika Alt account. These are the stats very quickly, but most importantly, this is a clue scroll relic account, which means I want to complete clue scrolls. Now you may be wondering, well, why are you doing clue scrolls in a game mode that's disappearing in January? Well, to keep it simple, I simply love opening clue scrolls. It is one of my favorite things in the game. And that is why I decided to do 100 beginners, 100 easies, 100 mediums, 69 hards and well 3 elites. Now the reason for elites is simple, I'm gonna do more of these if this video does well. So if you guys wanna see more clue openings and when it comes to hards and elites especially, uh, let me know in the comments and maybe give the video a like just so you let me know that I should continue and maybe do a lot of hard clues and elite clues before the end of the trailblazer. This video is going up on the 24th of December and I'll schedule it so it's gonna be on the Christmas Eve basically. And the reason for that is, well, I simply wanted to wish everyone a very happy Christmas. Now I know this year was probably rough for a lot of people, me included, and because of that I wanted to have this video out uh, on Christmas basically, so everyone can see it if they so wish. With that being said, we're gonna check our collection log and go straight into the clue scroll opening. This video might be quite long, but you know what? We're gonna have our fun opening the clue scrolls. I'm looking forward to it, let's see what do we get. The tab is created, we are starting with the beginner clue scrolls and what we want from this is just as many uniques as possible, uh, I don't really care when it comes to all the other things, uniques is what we are after and the drop rate is 3 times increased, so for example, see, this is one of those things that you can expect, we're gonna be getting a lot of points, we can even wear this for even more, more points, and so on, we're gonna be just opening this probably as fast as I can, get all these cool little drops that are, you know, nice to look at, and uh, I'm gonna wait for that little thing to disappear every time, just because it might be a bit annoying for the openings, but as you can see, in quite some occasions, we do get duplicate uh, drops of unique items, which is always fun. 82 to go, and let's just, I, I want to go through these as fast as I can, uh, I obviously got another pair of those, ooh, and look at that, that was a triple unique, wow, look, we, we, we have so many uniques already done, and I'm really looking forward to just checking uh, what we are missing in the collection log as we go, another unique there, and, and this is, beginners are always gonna start off a little bit slow, right, it's literally, um, well, actually, speaking of slow, we're getting a ton of points that I honestly didn't even know um, that you get that many points from beginners. Uh, but we're just gonna keep opening. There's not that many cool stuff, but the the hardest the tier we go towards, the better the rewards will be. And as soon as we reach something like medium clues, we can hit on those ranger boots or wizard boots or like cool stuff like that. So I'm once again going to speed through this as fast as I can. And we are basically halfway done with opening the beginners. So we keep going. I'm missing six drops. I quickly cheated and checked the collection log. So we are missing like the mole slippers, I believe, and some other drops, which I guess I could quickly show. So mole slippers, frog slippers, sandwich lady outfits, that's what we want to get. That didn't make any sense, the English was a bit broken there, but you know what, it's totally fine because most of you understood me regardless. I think those were the unique, the frog slippers just then. I've gotten a bunch of shoulder parrots, which you know what, it's nice, but at the same time it isn't. So we're just gonna quickly open more, that's another sandwich piece, but I think I already had that. And we keep clicking, 20 left to go, mole slippers, that's a unique. I'm actually gonna check the collection log and see what we are missing. There's another frog, hey, and we've gained 35 unique clues from beginner, more points there, very solid, very, very solid. Keep going, 10 more to go, another frog slipper drop, and let's see the collection log very quickly before we finish off with the beginners. And we are 13 out of 16, we're missing the hat and the top, black pickaxe we will get from easy clue scrolls most likely, because it's very common. I just received two shoulder parrots in one beginner clue scroll. So, looking at the whole beginner clue scroll opening, Fairly solid, 101 completed, 13 out of 16 items obtained. The total value of the tab, 4.4 million. Now we're gonna move on swiftly towards the easy caskets, and let's see if we can get some good drops here. I'm not going to lie, I'm mostly excited for mediums and hards, but you know what? This is going to be just as fun. And here's the first completion for 50 points. Fill 5 easy clue collection slots. Very nice. I've also kind of forgot to pimp my account up, I'm not even gonna lie, so... 
Okay, there is 10 unique collection slots. I feel like this is going to go up so fast. Uh, our character is looking very weird at the moment, but hopefully we can change that as we go. Look at us, very solid. Ooh, flared trousers. Now that is one of the items I was kind of hoping to get because if we get master clue scrolls, we are obviously going to complete them, or try to complete them. And for one of the steps, you do need flared trousers. And that's a fairly rare drop to get, so that's a very good thing to get off an easy clue scroll. We got a bo goblin mask, very nice there. Um, so yeah, two uniques, one unique, very solid. We can also get prayer bonuses from those. And I also do not want to be losing items to the ground. That is not what we want to do. Um, loot tab up to 5 million already. Very nice. Some pages. Oh, another thing I would really want to get would obviously be a Master Scroll Book. Because with Eternal Jewel Relic, which is what I have, you can actually click the Master Scroll Book, um, put the teleports in it, and it... It acts basically as infinite teleport, so it's a really good thing to have. Uh, but for now, let's just keep opening three uniques in that clue scroll. Very nice. And all these teleports, Piscatoris teleports, stuff like that, those are all the drops that we want. As I said earlier, those are infinite teleports right there. There's 35 uniques, and after 35 uniques, I don't think there's many more things you can get. However, you know, I just like to see clue scroll openings. This is like my favorite thing in the entire game, I'd say. To, to, to do and there it is the very first master clue scroll now luckily they are the boxes so you know what that means we can just keep opening the clue scrolls and we can do masters in another video once again if this video does well I will do more clue scroll openings before the end of trailblazer now on my channel I've done clue scroll openings a lot and these seem to be always the videos that people like to see the most I don't know what it is I feel it's just the fact the amount of time it takes to gather that many clue scrolls people just genuinely enjoy seeing the openings and I personally love it and and, and at the end of the day you know when I'm uploading the video and I see that people enjoy uh, it, it just it just makes it all worth it even though this took me a long time to do basically I kind of double click there so I think we skipped one of the loots but you know what it's all good we get a what is this stuff of Bob the cat tell me in the chat if you ever knew that stuff of Bob the cat exists in runescape I did not know that item was a thing I'm gonna be completely honest I had no clue that that oh Hey, look, we got another one. <laughs> back to back. Armadillo Roblex with White Barrett. Very cool. We will have fashion choices, possibilities, you know, many of them at the end of this opening. And there it is. 50 clue scroll. Collection slots completed for 250 points. I started at 15k points exactly. We're up to 16k 630. So we're definitely getting lots and lots of... What is this? Started body T. Oh, okay. I didn't know that it looked like that. It has like a black outline. Kind of cool, honestly. Uh, but yeah, we are uh, almost ending with our easies over here. We have 22 left to go. Uh, I could quickly check the collection log and see approximately what drops we are trying to get from here. Uh, I am not sure if we ended up getting a black pickaxe drop from these. Because that's what we need for our... Uh, beginners. Uh, but you know what? Let's quickly check the collection log. If I can find it in this mess. There it is. Easy clue scrolls, we have 53 out of 131 items, very cool. Did we end up getting... Yeah, we got 3 black pickaxes, so that is very, very nice. They count towards the other opening as well, so that's very, very cool. 10 more to go. Ooh, rainbow. Wow, I didn't know that was a thing. And that's a wooden shield G, very, very cool. Uh, I personally absolutely love the G items. I think they look the best. It's I, I, I have like the most nostalgic feeling wearing anything that has G trim around it. I think it looks very cool. And there is a second master clue scroll. Would you look at this? Holy, this clue scroll. Four uniques in one clue. Now that's what I love about leagues right there. So let's quickly pick everything up right here. If I can quickly take all of that up, there it is. And if we were to bank everything, we're up to 17.8 million. Um, in, in money value. So very nice. Now we're moving on to fun stuff. We're moving on to mediums. If you have been thinking about Fashionscape, this is what I can offer you from the beginner clue scroll opening and easy. Uh, but yeah, as I said, let's move on to the mediums. And this is the exciting part. We want to get ranger boots. We want to get holy sandals. We want to get wizard boots. We want to get all the cool stuff like that. So let's just start opening. No way! You are kidding me! What? On a very... Okay, wait, I need to take a screenshot of that. On a very fir Well, on the second medium clue scroll, we get ranger boots. 
and wizard boots. I'm taking a screenshot. This is just too cool to miss, honestly. Save this one. Oh my lord. Right, this is gonna be so fun. Let's keep opening. Oh my god, back-to-back -back masters as well. Dude, nothing can top that. Nothing can top that, honestly. There is not a single thing that can top that first clue scroll. If we wear the ranger boots, look at the points, 100. What about wizard boots? Ah, that would be too good, huh? Man, that is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. We can also get the prayer bonus reward. I also ended it ended up eating one purple sweet because that gives you like prayer bonus stuff and that's points. Uh, but let's just keep opening, man. At this point, I am just a happy man. I got everything I wanted on my second ever clue scroll. Now that's just perfect. This stall is gonna be great for prayer bonus. These headbands, I think I might need them for clue scrolls. And uh, yeah, this is just as good as it gets really. And there it is. Fill 20 medium collection slots. This one skipped. This was actually a triple unique in one. This is a double unique in one. Actually triple unique in one again. Dude, this is crazy how many points are in clue scrolls. Now, I never knew that this is how many points you actually get from them. What is this, a Bandos? No, a Zami. We might want to get a Bandos cloak, depending on how masters feel, but this opening is just beautiful. And there it is, second pair of boots, wizard boots number two. Absolutely wonderful. Look at the price of the bank. Well, when I put the ranger boots in, this is gonna go up by a lot. Uh, holy moly, man. This is so fun, honestly. The mediums with three times increased drop rate. And would you look at that? Spiked manacles also obtained. With that one out of the way, I think I got every medium clue scroll that I could ever ask for. What is this? Bandos cloak as well? That's exactly what I said I might still need. And if I... I'm, I'm literally gonna take the collection log right here. And we're gonna quickly... Take a look at our medium situation right here. Holy Sandals, I guess is the last item we are shooting forward to get. Uh, so let's just keep clicking, keep opening. Oh man, I'm a happy man right now. Right, here we go. Boom, Mitre and Arma Page. And that's 40 medium collection slots completed for some extra points. Very nice. So, no, don't tell me this went here. <gasps> Alright, I fixed it. Right, here we go. Keep opening. There it is. Very nice. Okay, so, oh my god, right as I was about to say, I'm losing the train of thought, I'm not quite sure what else to say, because it's just a close scroll opening, we got a second pair of ranger boots, that is going to increase our bank value by way too much, but you know what, that is totally fine, I am totally okay with that, nice, and I didn't voice crack there, by the way, oh, I didn't think about that, my bank is full, well, I... I have to do something to fix this. So, <laughs> right, give me a moment. We're fixing our bank situation. All right, there is a probability I might need to clean my bank another time, but let's keep opening the clue scrolls. There's another master, and we keep on going. Right, at this point, I there's not that many things that I will still need, so it's kind of just clicking stuff, honestly. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait, I dropped all of the things. Oh, maybe I need to hop worlds real quick. Um. Well, if I lost something, it's in this pile. Let's just move over here because I, I don't want to deal with that right now. Uh, so we keep opening. What is this? Another Bandos Cloak, the second one of the opening. Crier's Bell is there. Very nice. So the problem with mediums is you kind of have to bank all the time as you open them. Now, I could be a professional YouTuber and edit all of that out, but you guys know me. I just like to talk open clue scrolls and not really care. No Mish Firelighter, that's kind of cool. Oh, one of the tasks that I can do is to actually color a log and then open that. Oh, and there it is! Climbing Boots G. Well, it's not quite Holy Sandals, it's not quite anything I need, but it is Climbing Boots G, so now we are really only missing the Holy, holy Sandals to have everything done. Um, and I think another task is to have full book completed, but never mind, I don't actually have Fremenic for that. So that's not something we can do, but we can get another pair of wizard boots. Uh, that is very, very nice. We're, we're adding that to the, to, to the collection. Pest control teleports, good. Tybo one-eye teleports, amazing. Uh, I'll make sure to pick those up in a moment here. Very nice. There it is. Those are going to be useful teleports. Uh, another master clue. So basically for the next video, what I want to do is I want to do hard clue scrolls, elite clue scrolls, and master clue scrolls. Uh, once again, if you guys want to see that, I would really appreciate if you just let me know in the comments. That's like 
comments and likes are literally the simplest things that can help the videos get out there and you'd, you'd basically help me out big time by just doing that but anyways we have 19 left to go 18 17 um, and we're basically almost done with this now at this point I'm very very excited for the hard clue scroll openings But at the same time I feel like I won't have the bank space to really stack everything in there now Luckily I am doing all of these openings on rune light so that will track all the drops for us So even if I end up needing to put something in my house for example Or I might even need to make something in my house in the first place to even be able to put something in there um that might be something we might have to do. Two more mediums. Let's see. Yeah, my bank is full again. And there it is. At the very end. No way. At the very end, we get holy sandals as well. Which means that we have completed every single boot, I think. That I could get from a medium clue. If we open this, medium clue scroll. Look at how beautiful this looks. We all... Wow. I, we must have gotten so lucky. 82 out of 115 items, every single boot drop. If I just scroll through this, just, this is just a wonderful thing to see. Wow, this is this is good, man. This is good. Look at the... I have full adamant G. Wait, let's wear that. Hold up. Um, let's wear that. How could I do this? Throw all of this here. Adamant G. If I can find it over here, something hidden. It could be a task. Who knows? It's a fashion scape for sure. Look at us. God damn. We look goddamn fine. Right. Uh, Ranger boots as well. And this would be, uh, I guess, the outfit that we get from opening the medium clues. We surely look like an absolute beast. I somehow managed to get over 80 more spaces for my bank because I really want to have this whole tab just to see every single drop we've got. And, well, it's time to move on to 69 hard caskets. Uh, we've banked everything, and we are up to 104 mil right now. Absolutely crazy number there. Let's start opening, and we should be getting a ton of points from this. I am so excited. Uh, and Master Clue Scrolls. But one thing I still haven't seen, and I'm very surprised about it, is the fact that there has been no Master Scroll Books yet. It is a pretty rare drop, uh, but it's not, like, insanely rare. I mean, it is, but it isn't, you know? So I don't want that to be the one item that we do not end up getting. I think at this point, I would love to get more stuff like this, um, uh, but also Gilded Piece. A Gilded Piece or a third age piece, something really cool, is what I would absolutely love to see. And there's a second piece of Zamorak alongside a Crozier as well. Uh, it would be really cool to get, like, a full blessed... That's what I mean. Now I have the full uh, top, legs, uh, everything almost. The boots are missing, I guess. Um, very nice. And Zamorak is one of my favorite things as well. And there is fill 15 hard clue scroll collection slots for 100 points. If we look at the points, we're already up to 18k. So just in this opening alone, we ended up getting more than 3,000 points. We end up getting the rune helm, which is a requirement for one of the steps. Which means we can do this easier right now. We can no longer skip that step. Uh, so that's very nice. Narda teleports are not useful for us. Another band of scoif, we will take it. Now this video, at this point, is probably going to be fairly long already. So, oh, there it is. Zami bracers as well. Can we get the Zamorak boots? If we can get Zamorak boots on top of everything, we can wear full Zami and that would be sick. Look at the amount of uniques in this clue scroll, guys. Five different hard clue scrolls uniques in just one click. That is wild. Another Zami Bracers, not what we need. Another Zami Bracers, and that's fill 30. Hard Clue Scrolls Collection Logs. Just, just showering points for us right now. Now, this is gonna be awesome, because when the leagues end this account, all these points, very nice, are basically free points. And there it is. First, got the hide boots. It's not Zamorak, but it's definitely something that's pretty cool. However, we got Ranger boots, so who cares about that? And there it is! The item that I wanted, the Master Scroll book okay we I, I want to test it I want to test it if they implemented it correctly so we can come right back here in a moment but if I take let's say a teleport to let's say for example Piscatoris the reason why Piscatoris is so useful is because it is right next to a fairy ring so if I were to take a Draymond staff on top and a glory just so we can get back let's see if this is working correctly so set as default Yes, and now every time I left click here, it will teleport me straight there. So let's see if this is right. It works. Infinite teleports, boys. Look at this. So if I fill this up at the end of the clue scrolls, I'm going to do that. 
I am now, well, it's not, it's pretty close. I think it's the easiest one for this. Maybe if there's others and you guys think about them, once again, let me know in the comments. Another useful one is Lumberyard Teleport. Uh, let me show you. So let's say at some point I want to train some rune crafting on this account, which let's be honest, it's not going to happen. Um, but if I have Lumberyard and I use it in here, I can do this as well. So I can go right here and we are right next to an earth altar. Probably making it the best method uh, unless you're a recall uh, a relic thing to train rune crafting. So those are two very, very cool things. Very happy I got this. Looking forward to filling it up with every single teleport, uh, which we will do at the end of opening if we get all the teleports, that is. But this is definitely one of those cool drops that I absolutely wanted to get on this account. It's going to also make doing clue scrolls. Much, much easier, believe it or not. So, 43 left to go. What is this? That is four uniques in that one. That is three uniques in that one. That is, ooh, a god dehyde shield as well. Two uniques, three uniques in this one, including the helm. That is just crazy how good it feels opening these clue scrolls. Two uniques in this one. Absolutely lovely. Right, we still have over 30 to go. I do not know how much space I have in the bank. We still have about 40. I think we might actually be able to make it. So uh, I think at the end of the opening, I might be uh, doing a bit of bank reorganization. Oh my god, we did it. Boys, look at that. We got the Zamorak legs. Right, hold up. I think I am able to have full Zami. Hold up. Let's add the shield to, to the thing as well. Is that a task? It is. 100. Oh my. We look sick, no? Do you add this and then you have a whip and a defender? And you look like an absolute beast. I love the way we look. Wow, that's sick. Right, we still got a few to go. 30 actually, that's not even a few, that's quite a lot. Oh, I only took one. So yeah, let's just keep going. Let's just keep opening. Let's see if we can get something else that's cool. I would really love to top this video off with some third age. Oh, there's a second master scroll book. And there's some dual size, two uniques in that opening. Uh, nothing really special there. Okay, let's pick everything up. Nothing goes to waste on this account. We put everything right here in our loot tab and we still got 28 to go. That's Bandos Chaps there. That's another Gothix uh, boots alongside two extra uniques. Actually, three uniques there. Nothing in this one. A green dragon mask in that one. Very cool. 23 left to go. Let's try to speed it up a little bit. Um, that is a Reddy High Chaps T and Gothic Chaps there, very solid. That is a Rune Cane, definitely unique. Armadil Chaps. Armadil is another thing that looks absolutely phenomenal in my opinion. Um, when you have a full set of it. Now this account does give, have Asgarnia unlocked, however I don't really think I'll dive into PVMing much. I think this account is going to be strictly Clue Scrolls, because Clue Scrolls are fun. Look at the value of this Clue Scroll, 1.7 million, 4 uniques there. Very nice. Another dual Psy. Four uniques here. Thieving bag. Hey, we have something for our back. Very nice. 13 openings left to go. At this point, there is not much else to get, I guess. Let's just open this 10. I'll pick everything at the end. Another that. Another ancient coif. Boom. Bam. Any gilded pieces? Please. Two. One. And... Boom. Okay, what an opening. Oh my god, look at the floor. Let me quickly click and loot all of that. This is just... It reminds me so much of Twisted League. If you guys watched me back then, I used to do so many clue scroll openings. Everyone would love the clue scroll openings. And, dude, this just brings it all back. This is, this is just great. And now, for the cherry on top. For the, you know, just as a icing on the cake, how, how they say it. Three elite caskets. Let's see if we get something cool. I don't care about Mimic because we cannot do it anyways. That's the first one for 100 points. Actually, nothing cool in that one. Uh, one more for some musketeer pants. And that's a unique as well. Extra points. And then another one. I'm gonna wait for the thing to go, boom, there it is, ladies and gentlemen, this has been the opening of the Trailblazer Leagues, once again, if you wanna see more of this, oh, I'm missing one space, I cannot add the bracelet, you know what, we are getting rid of a rune mace. There it is. So we now have official price check, uh, thanks to Runelight, which is 118 million. My god, this is sick. Right, if you guys are wondering about the specific 
um, prices of every single clue scroll. Um, from elites, 500k from three. Clue scrolls, 69 for 16 million. When it comes to mediums, one wasn't counted because I clicked it too fast. Let's say around 82 million. When it comes to easies, around 13 million. And when it comes to beginners, around 5 million. I quickly organized the bank post editing. This is how it looks like. I didn't really do a great job at it. There is a lot of items that need to be organized here. But perhaps one thing that I missed was to check the collection log and see the progress we've made. The beginner clue scrolls, 14 out of 16 in 101. Easy's 62 out of 131 in 101 clues when it comes to mediums this is where we were by far the luckiest 82 out of 115 items already obtained moving on to hearts 68 out of 158 majority of the items missing is basically just the turbo rare items that realistically we will probably not get happy with the full completion of zamorak very happy with it in fact uh, moving on to elites we have one out of 98 uh, items completed when it comes to shared treasure trails um, We are still missing a couple of books. We wouldn't have completed a single page yet I do not think never mind. We have a bandos page completed if we had Fremenic unlocked um, And that is that is it. I really do sincerely hope you guys did enjoy this video It was an absolute blast to do this for you all um, If you enjoyed a simple like goes a very long way and I will see you again very soon. I guess with another video. Now, once again, if you want to see more openings, just leave a like, let me know in the comments. I can work my ass off to get a ton of clues and open them at the very end of the leagues. We ended up getting over 3,690 points. Very, very cool. Hey, shout out to Whitehard. <laughs> my man.